Hey everybody, this is Jen from Scan and Cut Jam Sessions and Scan and Cut Canvas and Scal Help on Facebook. Okay, what I'm doing um, right now is I'm making up one of those yard signs, you know, for the like the high school kids that play sports or in band or something like that. Um, I'm making up a football sign for my son who plays football. So I have this here, okay? Well, I don't want to cut it out of vinyl because man oh man you imagine cutting out all those white things and having to place them no thank you um so what i want to do is well if i can print it out i want to do that but i don't want to print it on paper because out in the rain well it's just going to fall apart so i do have the printable um oracle 651 um so what i want to do is i want to print this so that it all comes out looking like this so i have this in scale um, so I'm going to go ahead and print it. Well, you get all excited because you know that you can do that. You can come up here, um, and I always forget where it's at. Uh, let's see here, right here. Oh, gosh darn it. Okay, so here it is, but you have to remember that you have to change the lines. These are just set cut lines, right? Okay, you come up here. Well, actually, I already changed it, and I thought, wait, I got to do a tutorial because I haven't done one of these yet got to come here to the wrench to the cut line type it's always set at cut so we need to change it print print something it's got to be print so print cut cut print cut print whatever you want to do okay so then come here to preview and I only have show printable okay clicked so I know that this is gonna print now okay so before when it was oops sorry before, when it was just cut, ha, I think I'm pretty smart. I send that right to my printer. Well, it's not actually going to print because even though it says show printable, it will not come up on your printer. It'll print out a solid black because I've done it before. And it's horrible. So you waste the whole entire sheet of your um, paper. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here have a Wi-Fi printer so that I can send this right now I can send it over there so I'm going to make sure all of my properties are set right and I have I have a wide format printer and what I do first though before I go wasting any paper is to make sure that this works I put in 11 by 17 paper so let's see if they even have it listed in here maybe up in here they don't even have my paper listed so let's go with something that's kind of close I can go up to I think it is 13 by 20 they have 11 by 14 well you know what let's just do that we'll just try that and we'll print it's on It's on HP, actually it's premium white. You click OK. Print selection only. And click it and I'm sending it to the printer right now. So we'll be back and see what we've got. Okay, you can go check on the part two of this tutorial where I actually use my camera. Um, the test worked perfectly, so I am going to go ahead and I am going to send this to print um, on, I trimmed up the Oracal 651 to the shape of my actual board that I'm going to put it on. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and print it. I'm going to click the print selection only. I'm going to make one copy for now. <clears throat> I'm going to get it all printed out. And then um, if you want to go to the next video, it'll be the part two. Um, and we'll show you how we get this all made up. All right. Thanks, guys. And another thing, do not believe the preview, even though it showed on here. Um, when I didn't have show printable, hang on, when I did not have, the print 
and I had this checked. Don't believe that. It came out all black when I did it, okay? So it looks like it'll work, and maybe for you it will, but I'm telling you this. Just please make sure that you change over here to print so that you can ensure that it works because the printable 651 isn't that cheap. All right, guys, thanks a lot. See you on part two.